Hi guys, Leila Severian, Regional Director for Camp Gladiator here with the beautiful Christine Donaldson. We're here to show you our ballerina boot camp in our Oakley Women's Training Tip Series. We're gonna start off, um, all you need for this workout is a yoga mat and maybe a chair for balance. We're gonna start off with releves. So Christine's gonna step, she's gonna use the chair for balance. Her heels are gonna be together and she's gonna have about two inch space between her toes. She's gonna come up, off onto her toes and right back to her heels, keeping a nice moderate pace to start making sure you're acting like someone's pulling a string all the way through the top of your head. Beautiful. Now we're gonna double time it and we're gonna start really speeding up those releves, making sure every time you take it down, heels bounce right off the ground. Perfect, Christine, you got four more. Three, awesome. Two, one, perfect. Now we're dropping down. We've got our wide plie squat. She's gonna go nice and wide to make sure her knees are tracking over her ankles. She's gonna drop it down and bring it right back up. Drop it down, back up. As she takes it down, deep breath, inhale, and exhale as you bring it up. Make sure your seat is tucked under, and you're trying to take your knees and push them back behind you to really squeeze and push those hips forward, opening up the hips in this exercise. Now taking it all the way down to a pulse, and pulse. Perfect job. There we go, last four. Three, is it burning? Two. One, good. Our next one is our parallel plie. She's gonna use the chair for balance again. Feet are about hip width apart, maybe even a little bit more narrow if you feel comfortable. She's gonna tuck her seat under, bend her knees, and she's gonna come up again to her highest heel. She's gonna drop it down to her lowest point where she feels comfortable and all the way back up. Make sure that you guys, when you're dropping it down, go to where you feel comfortable. Don't feel like you have to drop it all the way to the ground, even though maybe at the club that's what you like to do. All right guys, now drop it down. We're gonna pulse here, Christine, and just stay here for the last 10, nine, good, eight, Seven, your quads should really be feeling it right now. Three, two, one, back up. We're gonna work on donkey kicks and hamstring curls using the same chair for balance. We're gonna face the same direction. She's just gonna keep her right leg that's closest to the chair bent um, for balance. Take her left leg bent, pointed toe, and start pushing back against her tuck. So when I talk about a tongue th tuck, think about somebody punching you in the stomach, really rolling those hips under, but then opening up the chest nice and wide. Now she's gonna flex the foot, keeping her heel as close to the tushy and still press back. She's engaging this glute. Some would call it the dancer's dent. Good, perfect job. Awesome, and last four, three. You're still gonna keep it up. Two, one, now pull that heel as close to the booty as possible. And up, back down, good. Last four. Three, lift it up, two, one. Oh, are your hamstrings feeling it? Okay, let's get them a little bit more before we end. So we're gonna come right over here, dropping it down. She's gonna lay flat on the mat, both feet down, knees are bent. She's gonna take one leg straight up, keeping her hips on the ground, and then she's gonna come up onto her heel. She's gonna raise all the way up to her highest point, drop it back down, bouncing her booty up every time. Good, every time she comes up, she's gonna exhale. When she takes it down, inhale. Perfect job, you have three more, here we go, three, good. Two, last one, and stand up at the top, hold it here for a second, now let's pulse it out for the last 10, nine, eight, seven, six, you got it, four, three, two, one. That's your ballerina booty workout. If you want long toned legs with a very lifted seat, do this workout, you're sure to look good.